Wow! We whoa! Whoa! That's the we're starting sirens. Woo! <laughs> this for Silent Hill. I'm just handing you this now. Hi, everybody. Oh yeah, give me, of... give me the cat blanket. We're gonna yeah. need it. Yeah. I mean, Olive's dead asleep right there. So but maybe she won't. Somebody's gonna show up. Joy's been in a mood, so who knows? And I'm gonna need this blanket when they do show up. I did make her a fort, but we'll see. How's everybody doing tonight? Uh, you, you may notice we're here an hour early. Yeah. Because daylight savings time has happened here in America. Benjamin Franklin decided something and we've never challenged it. We've never challenged it and twice a year the time just changes for no reason. And we all suffer. And now we all have to do things an hour different than we did for a while. Sucks, man. And eventually we'll, we'll change back again and have to do it different again. Yep. It's pretty messed up. But it's the life we live. Yeah. I fully expect this first stream back will have less viewers. <laughs> <laughs> until about halfway through the stream no they won't see me go through that old lady village again they're gonna miss it they're gonna miss the dancing old ladies they're probably gonna miss you beat that boss too if we're maybe being this honest. is the one i get stuck on it's i don't foresee that being possible <laughs> yeah maybe um i had seen someone asking about the my dad is josh gad name of the song uh and just to to reiterate it is um because that's the tuning i was using on the guitar d-a-d-g-a-d -D -D, affectionately referred to as dad gad tuning is an open tuning dad -gay. that i used and i played the song in it uh it is not the chord progression as someone else said it is the tuning little little dad gad if you've never played in Dadgad, give it a try. It's fun. Do it. It's a fun one. Wait, is there Jacob music out? It's not out, but it's getting closer. I did, thanks to help from People Need Goals, a.k.a. Jack, learn how to um, master the songs to make them sound better and be like kind of the same volume as each other, more or less. So the version you heard tonight is actually the mastered version. And if you, if you go back and listen to the old version, you will notice a, um, a pretty stark difference in clarity of the song. I, I played for Julia with like turning mm -hmm. the master track on and off. It was just like a little muddy. And it's like you're listening to the mastered one and like this is normal. And then you turn off the master track and you're like, oh my God, this sounds awful. Not awful. Not just awful. It's murky. just like a muddier, murkier version of the... Uh, the, and not even that murky. Ones. I think you, you did a great job first pass. It's just like a little... Got a, got a bump. You got a bump It's a got little a little bit. bump. It's got a little got more a bump it. pep in its step now. Yeah. So the songs are ready to go. I just got to put them together and figure out how to get them on the various services that they go on. So that's coming up next. Probably this week I'll, I'll get it done. Is that what they mean when a song is remastered? It is what it means, yeah. It basically means you're like adjusting the, the frequencies, the volume and width and breadth of the frequencies after the fact to like make it, to hopefully improve the clarity of the track and make it more, make it pop more. In any case, that's not important. Can you do this with your nose? Can everybody do that? It makes, it makes me look like I'm really worried. <laughs> okay, we're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna play the video game now. I did go ahead and replug the Elgato, so hopefully the audio is just, like, good. Oh, ho, ho. You thinking ahead of time. Yeah. We will see. We'll find out. You do need to unmute the Elgato, though. Okay. Before you switch.
Also, I should just say too, that I'm still very new to the music production thing. So take anything I say with a grain of salt in terms of like the, the factual definitions of what everything means. <laughs> Came into quite a noise. But I'm having fun. How do I play this game again? You just dodge and hit. Okay. And it's easy. Game sounds good so far? Hell yeah! Let's go! I love the laughing old ladies. Don't look... Don't look at me. I love that... So I'm trying to like categorize, it's National Women's Month, yeah. right? Yeah, Happy Women's Month. So I'm trying Happy to Women's categorize Pride. in my mind the Souls series women. I feel like they fall into like several categories. Happy Women's Month. One of them is definitely cackling and dancing. Yeah. Um. And another category is like sitting sadly in a chair and then they get up and are the hardest boss in the game. Yeah. That's like a separate category as well. But then there's a third category too, which is they are um, sort of like unrecognizable monstrosities. Okay. Like the, um, the gun women in Sekiro like the black knife assassins in Elden Ring. Can I just say real fast? They're just like ghouls. Yeah. This looks like a melty slice of cheese pizza. It does look like a melty slice of cheese that's pizza. That's all I wanted to say. Um, but yes, I I think that's like it. I think that's the three. You got it. Yeah, I think they're either ghouls. But do the men fall into that category too? I guess there's a lot of like dudes who are here to tell you information or something. I mean, there's always an informational lad. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't everybody be impressed that I remembered that the shortcut was here? I'm impressed. I didn't remember. Yeah. I forgot literal doll. She I guess falls in sitting sadly. She does sit sadly, but she's not a boss. But I mean, she falls in the category of um, the woman that, that helps you. Your in-game wife. In every FromSoft game, you have an in-game wife who helps you. Yeah. And only in Sekiro do you potentially have to fight her. That's true. In Sekiro, she is both your in-game wife and the woman who sits sadly. Oh, God, your cheese pizza. Gets up and is really hard. Sorry. You surprised me. Yeah, because you don't... I'm guessing you don't fight the doll in this one. Be fightable, or you just, like, kind of kick her butt? No, you don't... She's not fightable. I mean, you can, like, kill her, but she just comes back. That's probably for the best. I don't feel like fighting you here, man. I was going to say once you have a moment, but I don't actually need you to have a moment. You don't need me. I'm just going to turn the volume down a little bit. Oh my god. It seems to be getting pretty loud when it gets loud. <laughs> when the ladies start throwing? This game's like impossible to sound balance for. Yeah. Because it's either like so quiet and everyone's talking like... Yeah. Or like everyone is screaming at the top of their lungs. Keep... Can you actually bring it up like two notches for us, please? Really? Would you mind? Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> I don't know if your headphones are louder than mine. My, I have my headphones half off because they're too loud. Really? Yeah. Mine's not. Also, last time we played, you had me turn it up then as well. You've had me slowly increasing the volume every time we play. Hmm. Interesting. What do your headphones ladder. sound like? Give me your headphones. Okay. Julia's redefining. And you put on these. 
Julie, do you need to get your hearing checked? Not again! I'm gonna see if these are quieter. I feel like you're luring me. Oh, you were a crystal lizard. Or whatever. <laughs> luring you into getting an item that you didn't get. Yeah, I did not. Okay. I know there's stairs behind me. Let me fight. I know there's a lady around the corner with her mallet. I mallet insulted woman. her last time. The mochi lady? Yeah, mochi lady. Oh yeah, see yours are better. Yeah, these are definitely quieter. I don't know why that would be. Maybe it's because the padding on these is thicker. What the? Oh. Okay. 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 All right. Okay. Hmm. All right. Okay. Interesting. 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 Okay. Okay. Great work. Emotes are being delivered to supporters. What does that mean? Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Interesting. Olive just did a big stretch. Okay. Okay. Do we need to check like this? Is it on, is it supposed to be game capture? Yeah. Should I like switch it to something else and then switch it back? Oh. We're oh. We're back. We're back. Oh, ho, ho. We had to switch off and switch back. Oh, ho, ho, ho. And on National Women's Month. I've done it. Who runs the world? Skrulls! Someone in chat said, I saw myself in the darkness and I was not okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the jump scare. But you didn't die. That's what's important. Alan Brickman! Alan Brickman! What do you mean my echoes were retrieved? Who died? <laughs> Oopst. Someone who had your echoes just like <laughs> tripped and died, I guess. <laughs> she got her hot pizza. Hot pizza? Get your hot pizza here. Oh god. Watch out, he bricking. Oh god. Oh god. Ah. He's going full brick mode. Be so careful. Okay. Boink. The blackout happened just as you subbed, and for a second you thought it was your fault. <laughs> and maybe it was. Could have been. It might have been your fault. So, you know, apologize. Come at me, foul beast. What? what the hell? Did she call you a foul beast? Come out, you foul beast! 
She's allowed to do that. It's National Women's Month. You're right. And you've entered into a woman into a women's space. You're right. Uninvited. They were just cackling and eating hot pizza and throwing Molotov cocktails. <laughs> Be lived. Not for very much longer. You're gonna drop on her ass? Oh, you're just gonna shoot her. Disrespect. Upon you. Thank you. Okay. Hey, you're almost back to where you were. Yeah. When we left off last time. That's beautiful. I think it's great. Who breathing? Someone oh, really? said, I appreciate your RHPS reference, Julia. Red hot pilly schleppers. <laughs> Red hot Philly schleppers. Red hot Philly schleppers. Red hot Philly slice? Red hot pizza slice. <gasps> Rocky Horror Picture Show. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> did you make a reference to Rocky Horror Picture Show? I did. Did I you? Did. Or did you make a reference to Red Hot Philly Schleppers? Um, who's to say? So this is a shortcut you've opened. She slept on my Philly till I'm red hot. <laughs> <laughs> Not an international women's month, she doesn't. You need to schlep on her Philly. Ah. You didn't really care about my bullet. Sorry, that was disrespectful. Don't. You why why did you even come out here? I don't know. I got impatient. <laughs> you came out here backwards through the shortcut. I did just to get killed by Alan Brickman. Yeah. You didn't even need to. Yeah. Uh yeah, the line not for very much longer. Not for very much longer. Oh, that's what that's from? It's astounding. Time is fleeting. Madness. Control. Let's do the time warp again. At some point, he says, uh, not for very much longer. Let's do the time warp again. Ladies, ladies, ladies. There's enough Lim Lamoose to go around. You can. All oh, right. Listen, I know I'm hot. You don't have to make me hotter. Thank you. Jerk. They're having a great time. It's a good month to be a woman. Okay. I'll take that. Oops. Julia, it's not okay to one shot women <laughs> on National Women's Month. I got you need, stuck you need to on two shot them at least. Stop one-shotting them. It's disrespectful. I'm sorry. You have to two-shot. I just two can't shot. help it. Women, they're so fragile and weak, you know. So true. <laughs> Don't go that way. Okay. Go through the shortcut you opened. <laughs> She's so mad. She was very mad. Oh, here she comes. Oh, it's Miss Aliyev. It's Miss Aliyev. It's Miss Aliyev. Olive makes truly so many little noises, and each one of them delights me. I saw someone else in the corner of my eye. Miss Aliyev, you. you're a national woman. National woman, yeah. Okay. She's got the mochi hammer. 
Oh god. Oh, she purring. Oh, she purring. <laughs> you make me feel like a national woman. <laughs> You make me feel like a national woman. Saluting. <laughs> <laughs> Hand over the heart. One tear. One piece. There it is, your shortcut. And there's Alan Brickman with your blood echoes. Your blackos. I was too early. You were too early. I can't forget it. On the down. On the down. I can't get you there. You can. Oh, can I? Yeah, it's also parryable. Gory. Gory. I was almost too early again. But you weren't. But I wasn't. You were right on time, just as you mean you mean to be. Just, just as you I arrived, means to be. what right when you precisely when you a woman arrives precisely <laughs> when she means to a national woman. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Where are you going? Julia? What? Go through the gate. That's the, where I came from, though. That big gate. Yeah, That's what about the shortcut it? you opened. But I never went over there. That's just the normal way to go if you were going without having the shortcut opened. Is that true? Yes. Oh. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to tell you what to do on National Women's Month. Yeah, how dare you, man. I'm not Am I right? not letting her explore. She already explored it. <laughs> she already went, did all of that. Oh, uh, there's like a, a whole parade of women that are mad at me. <laughs> I love their little shoves. They're like bullying you. Yeah, they are. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, just keep swinging. This dude's outside like, hey, you aren't <laughs> roughing up the women in there, are you? This is their town. You have to respect them there. This oh is woman God. town. He's so big. That was the You had to dodge in on that yeah, one. Yeah, I did. I'm, like, scared. Don't, you've you've don't killed this guy me. before. Did I? You Remember, he was the first big guy you ever fought. Okay, yeah. I was wondering. Give me this. Thank you. Ah, there's a little guy. He was a little crystal lizard. Oh, was he? Yeah. Oh, God. I didn't realize there was a two-parter there. Okay. Nice. That's how we do it. That's how yeah. we do it. Toast his buns. Toasted your buns. All right, you're coming up on, as I've said before, what is widely considered the easiest boss in the game. That's... That makes me nervous. <laughs> does this apply pressure to you? It does. Wow. Wow. Look at that atmospheric perspective. You know what I want to know? Look. How do they get all them bodies up there? How do they get all them chains up there? You know? Seems like a lot of work. It's like a lot of work. We oui. That doesn't just happen naturally. I'm scared. Are you Did I draw you? What's What's kind of your deal? I'm hearing something. Um. That was a lady covered in barnacles? Do 
You found her, the barnacle witch. <laughs> That's Mr. Crab's wife. I hear things. Alright, well... They're just, they're so passive. <laughs> like, where the heck is that enemy going? I kind of respect it, though, you know? What is that? What is that? <laughs> they have a cool design. <laughs> <laughs> He's not threatening me. I'll be on my way. Oh. I don't see how it's my problem, frankly. I didn't ask to be here. Oh. <laughs> did, did you hit the barnacle witch? Did you hit our mother? I hear you. the wrong witch the wrong witch if the health bar doesn't go down it's the wrong witch she's up to so many tricks that's the wrong witch wrong witch that's the right witch that's our witch right there wow you did it did you do it oh you didn't do it I forgot the other witches are also the right witch. There's just more than one of them. You did it! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Boss defeated! All right. Fascinating. I think there's a don't don't go back. Don't go back. I think there's a back room. That room? Mm-hmm. That's their husband. Oh. Mr. Witch. Mr. Barnacle. That's Mr. Krabs. I'm a big fan of this like caved in second floor. Yeah, it's cool. As a way to like get the light on the And to like point to him mm -hmm. and kind of like close him in a little bit. It's the rune workshop tool. You can finally do the runes. Got a cool outfit. He's a hunter. And yet his wife was a monster, am I right? That's Mr. Krabs. Finally. Women can be monsters too. I love your paws are always together and it's so cute. And you got a lot of blood echoes to level up with. That's why I wanted to go back. I got excited. Welcome home, good hunter. What is it you desire? I got uh, a lot of things, like enough money to retire and not have to think about work anymore. Uh, very well. I think that's what everyone desires. Health care for everyone. Strength. Yeah, yeah. Let me stand close. That's weirdly not what everyone desires. A lot of people don't desire that for some reason. I think they do desire it, but they've been convinced that it's at the expense of um, themselves somehow. 
So I want to say too, if you feel like you would like more stamina, you can put a few points in endurance as well. Oh. If you feel like you're... I do like endurance. If you feel like you're lacking in stamina. And then just like strength and skill. Okay. I like it. That's, I like the, it. that's the vibe right now. Okay. Thank you. Hunters have told me about the church, about the gods and their love. But do the gods love their crime? Okay, we had this. Of course. I do love you. Isn't that? We did have this conversation and it made me sad. Yep, still Farewell, sad. Good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. There we go. That's what I say to myself every time I wake up in the morning. Yeah. Me, when I go to bed. So you got the new tool. Yeah, it's this thing, right? It's this thing. You can memorize a carol rune to acquire its eldritch strength. Carol. So you can use these. Max they... vials. Yeah, that gives you an extra vial. Love that. Or more bullets. Or more blood echoes from visceral attacks. That one doesn't really apply to anything as of yet. So you can What's just... a visceral attack? The... the... Oh, 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 when I parry? Yeah. Okay. I feel like this is just nice. Sure I've not is. needed it yet, but I think I will need it eventually. Right? It's always nice. I mean, it's just one vial, so it's not going to make or break you probably, but... I feel like I'm between this one and this one. What do you think? I feel like more blood echoes is always good, but it's only if you kill with a visceral. Yeah. So it's like if you plan to do that a lot, then it'd be helpful. I mean, I do do that a lot. Oh, you get three slots. That's right. So, so I, you can, so I can, you do, can do three. I forgot about that. Can I like turn them off too? Or is it like forever? No, you can change them whenever you want. Oh, great. Oh, great. Perfect. Mm -hmm. I just did that, huh? I can fortify. You want to give it a little... A little boost? Give it a little juice. Juice it up. Why not? I'm doing well at the game. I'm doing it. I defeated a woman on National Women's Month, which <laughs> makes me a true ally. I don't see gender. I eliminate all equally, <laughs> especially the women. I mean, <laughs> uh, the ads are about to start at some point. The ads have started. They're going right now. Look at these friends. So as far as where to go next. Yeah. It's one of those moments where it's a little unclear to you, uh -huh. the first time player. Right. I don't know if you would like any hints as to where to go, or if you just want to, like, like, set out. Pendant of Vicar Amelia used to change into a blood gem which fortifies weapons. This pendant passed down among the vicars who head the healing church as a reminder of the cautionary adage, Words that will open the gates of Bergenworth. So you got the you got the the password. Oh yeah. Yeah, which is fear the old blood. <clears throat> which we went up. We that was the door we went up to, and the guy was like password, and yeah. I didn't know, and then we had to run back. Yeah. So I should go towards them, probably, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Boygen Woith. Let's check out our fashions while the ads go. This 
always cool. Yeah, we do love that. Too cool for Lem? Maybe. The bonnet? I kind of love it. Lem's special bonnet? It, ha like, it has um, really bad stats, though, is the only thing. I look like one of the women from 101 Dalmatians that's in, like, the opening crawl. Or not the opening crawl, but where people are walking with their dogs. I think one um, of them has a bonnet. No! Ah. I look like... The scene in Alice in Wonderland with the oysters that I love to reference, they're wearing little bonnets and there's like an old lady in that scene or like an old clam. They're oysters. And he's kind of making this face. Yes, Mama Oyster. Mama Oyster. Mama. Mama Oyster. I heard bucket hats are in fashion. <laughs> in... I, I saw a youth wearing this on tickety tock. <laughs> no, we must be available to eat sour candies. Yeah, People keep, must keep the know. mouth. The mouth's got to be open. People must know. Well, not open. The <laughs> mouth has to be visible. Yeah. But closed, tightly closed. This is a cool outfit. Is it too cool for Lem? Sweaty clothes. <laughs> <laughs> it's up to you. You know, it's whatever you think. That's like too cool. That looks like I'm trying to do like a Civil War cosplay. This one gives me strong shoulders. That's a real Dracula ass one. Yeah, I'm kind of into the black church garb for him. Right here. Yeah, I like the black church garb. The gloves? They're cool. What kind of gloves would Lim wear? Mm, can't see that. Those look too cool for him. But those are too bulky. Maybe we'll go back to the surgical gloves. They're kind of like a little fancy. He's kind of a fancy little guy. Yeah. And you can't really see the shoes. Too well. Trousers don't matter. Yeah. <laughs> I'm ready. I, he does look like he's ready to go out into the London fog and be mean to some urchins. <laughs> Yeah, going out to my costume party. My Sunday costume party. Okay. What you got, a little book there? You gonna read? It's like a, it's like a case. It's not even a book, it has a handle at the top. He's got, got like a little, little lock box. Little lunch box? You got your little lunch in there? What you got for sale? I don't really have anything new for you, right? Repeating pistol. Sorry, your brother sent me a song. My brother? Yeah. Amazing. And said this song is awesome. Alright. The song is Strange World by La Luz. I've not heard it, but you can bet I'm going to listen to it. Look at these two. This, this is cool stuff. Tomb Prospector. If you want to prospect a tomb, there ain't nothing better to put on. Oh my god, it's a big hammer, huh? That's the sword that turns into the hammer. Right. And then you got also in there the sword that turns into a bigger sword. Ludwig's holy blade. And then the rifle spear that's a spear and a gun. My god. This was what I used for a large portion of my playthrough was Ludwig's holy blade. I don't feel like I need to change from my my dear old friend here. I suspect I know what you'll change to when you get it. 
but it won't be for a while. Which is about... Um, it was here, right? Is it Cathedral Ward that I go to? I'm trying to remember. That's yeah, kind of cathe far. Yeah, Cathedral Ward, I think, is the best option. I'm trying to remember where the door is. I think it's, like, down in that graveyard. Yeah. Through that graveyard. Yeah, I said the, the summer camp. Yeah. But I don't remember how to get there. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. I do remember how to get there. And that's a, a diggity-dang miracle. So how's everybody doing? Everyone okay in here? I do look like... I do look like I'm gonna yell about like what what's his name in um Christmas Carol? Little little Tim? <laughs> little, Tiny Tim. Little Tim. <laughs> Tiny. Small Timothy. <laughs> Tiny Tim. Like, what year is it? Go to hell. <laughs> Bring me small Timothy. <laughs> he owes me a hay penny. Bring me little Tim. How did we ever get into this mess? <laughs> um, I don't really like how you're laughing. As long as you don't hurt the lady up there and the person in the back, I'm good. I'd just like to say... Y'all watching this have heard how loud some of the combat has been. Excuse me, can you stop weeping? I'm trying to say something here. In the game settings, I've got the sound effects at a six, and the music at a six, and the voices at a 10. And yet, yeah. all voices are a good 10 decibels quieter still yeah. than the noise of combat. Is there like um? Let her cry. Let the tears fall down on you. <laughs> Let her go. What if I rally her? She do bleed, like blow, the bleed. Here, let's um. Let us bleed. Let's vamp. You got something you need to talk about? <laughs> Let us know. We can talk about it. Do you uh, listen? All she wants to do is weep and cry. Do you see these tight lips? Whatever you want to say, it's not getting out. I won't tell the secrets. I won't say anything. All right. Hey, this old lady won't stop weeping. Um, I said I wouldn't tell anyone, but you don't. You don't count. Oh, hello. So, uh, oh no, I still haven't used her blood yet. All right. Uh, this way. I don't think this way. Not this way. That leads to the the boys' dorm. This way. I think yeah, it's this, this, way, this way up and, and then left and left. And then down, yeah. Yeah. Down the big hill. <laughs> Bleh. Oh! Camaraderie! Damn, we're we doing kind sit. of a lot of damage, though. Yeah. Your damage is getting a little silly. <laughs> Thank you for the vials. Wow, you uh, happy to see me? He's tooting his horn. You're okay with that arm. Yeah, and then it's over here and then down the big hill. Yeah. That's right. There's an item over there. I really like how it looks when they walk. It's very dramatic. Thick blood. Thick blood. Thick cold blood. Thick cold blood. Okay, yeah, and then it's like across the way, I think. Yeah. Look, the big guys are sleeping now that it's uh, later at night. That's so cute. I can explore. They don't get to lay down to sleep. They just have to kneel. This is why we need unions. All right. This is why we need workers. 
unions. The right to sleep. Let him do his thing. Don't worry about him. Yeah. Is it killing bosses that makes time pass? I believe so. As I recall. Well, you're kind of sleeping in an inconvenient place. It's Vicar Amelia specifically. Do I have to go that way? Is it that way? Or can I go this way? I don't remember. Oh. I don't think it's this way. Yeah, I also don't think it's this way. I think it's, I think it's the other way. Past the large lad. Tippy toes, Lem. Tippy toes. I think it's not this way. Yeah. I think it's the other way. It's a different exit of the sleeping camp. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> don't be that kind of person. <laughs> How dare you? He's got some real... <laughs> Lem. Some real tight skin on there. Not that way. Not this way? Back up to the... Cemetery. Just run. <laughs> I didn't want to wake up the boy. He's been working so hard. I think it's up here and then like left. It's like a different. Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's that like way over there. Well, this seems bad. Oh, you strong. He's not going to wake up unless you smack him. You strong. Arm. Oh, watch out, it's a schlorper. Yeah. Oh, I remember. He's still alive, Julia! Come on, man. Asshole. What you sent? What you spit? What you spit? He's the red hot Philly schlorper. <laughs> Who's punching? Don't worry about that. Who's shooting? Let him shoot. There's a corpse on that. On the stairs. Oh, it's the, the, the wall puncher. The password. Could you like get through it quicker? It's National Women's Month. <laughs> Women could be speaking right now, but you won't shut up. It's like a little bit what it's like to talk to a toddler. There we go. He's done. Was that you? He's already dead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Good skill. He was just waiting to perform his one last task. You know what? Then he should have taken his time like he did, you know? He waited so long. That's really good. Hello? Oh, it's not. There's no lantern. I was ready.
Um, I'm not allowed to be here. You're ready to go into a real fucked up place. Fan love in a fucked up place. Fan love in a fucked up place. You're Holland? Gonna, you're not. This. Yeah, that's what I. When I said a fucked up place. You meant Holland? I meant. Well, it's called the Netherlands. Uh, but the area where all of the windmills are is called Holland. You ass. It's National Women's Month. You ass. Damn. I actually don't know if that's true. I think that's true. Is I that could, true or are I you just making shit up. up? I don't know. My parents went. That's what they told me, but. The netherworld. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from the Netherlands. You're right. Fuck. Yes. It's also because my favorite national soccer team is the Netherlands. And I kept like getting it confused between Holland and the Netherlands. So I looked it up like a million times. Sue. So. Meow, meow. All right. I knew that was going to happen. Meow. What is wrong with your face? I mean, handsome lad. Holy shit, you did a lot of damage to me. Maybe I shouldn't let you hit me. I gotta remember to hit the bodies. Yeah, give them, give them a couple more whacks next time. Yeah. <sighs> Your damage is kind of sick, though. It is sick. Wow. Look at that building. That's cool. You like how much I use the monocular? Yeah. You knew the second I got the monocular what we were, you were gonna for. You were gonna look at some stuff? Yeah. For sure. It's large lad season. It's the month for women. Julia, I hate to say this to you, a woman, but this could be a woman. You're right. You're absolutely right. Thank you for keeping me honest and correct, Jacob. In fact, I think it is a woman based on the way she just beat your ass on National Women's Month. <laughs> Anyone who wins this month is a woman. Yeah. Women more like win men. That's what I always call them, personally. When men gonna step up is what I say. Did you not find a lantern? Nope. I think maybe that should be your focus. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that the second I died. I was like, uh oh, spaghetti. Might be better to follow the path of. Uh, obviousness until you reach a lantern someone said assigned woman at win <laughs> very good what is with your scythe do you have like moon powers moon powers moon powers yeah scream all you want losers i'm out of here i'm going to the forbidden woods jane ivory said jacob i thought monsters were all non-binary not that one not that one. That one's a woman. You could just ask me if you're confused. I'll tell you which ones are which. <laughs> I, I've got a list, so I know. Oh. When the hell did you get here? Alfred. Were you here the whole time and I just missed you? Oh, good to see you safe. Now, let's think up something to discuss. What? Just tell me what piques your interest. The weather. I just want to uh, clear this up real quick because a lot of people in chat are saying non-binary women exist. That's true, but not that one. Yeah. <laughs> she's she's not non-binary. Yeah. You can just ask me. I know. He's part of the healing church, right? Yeah. Ask him about everything. Okay. As you know, the healing church is the fountainhead of blood healing. Well, I'm a simple hunter quite unfamiliar with the ins and outs of the institution. But I have heard that the holy medium of blood healing is venerated in the main cathedral. And that counselors of the old church reside in the high stratum of the cathedral ward. If you seek blood healing and the church is willing, you should pay them a visit. I don't think I will. They kind of, they, they kind of sound messed up, my dog. Bergenworth is an old place of learning. 
and the tomb of the gods carved out below Yarnum should be familiar to every hunter. <laughs> well, once a group of young Bergenworth scholars discovered a holy medium uh -huh. deep within the tomb. Uh -huh. This led to the founding of the healing church uh -huh. and the establishment of blood healing. In this sense, <laughs> everything sacred in Yarnum can be traced back to Bergenworth. But today, the college lies deep uh -huh. within a tangled wood. Really? Abandoned and decrepit. And furthermore, the healing church has oh. declared Bergenworth <clears throat> forbidden ground. It's unclear how many of its scholars remain alive. <laughs> but only they know the password uh -huh. that allows passage through the gate. Uh -huh. Ask about the corrupted vile bloods. Ah, there's something I want to tell you. Uh -huh. A bit of wisdom from the eminent master Lugarius. Once, a scholar betrayed his fellows at Bergenworth and brought forbidden blood back with him to Canehurst Castle. It was there that the first of the inhuman vile bloods was born. The vile bloods are fiendish creatures who threaten the purity of the church's blood healing. The ruler of the vile bloods is still alive today. Damn, is it me? And so, to honor my master's wishes, I search for the path to Canehurst Castle. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Farewell. It has been a pleasure. May the good blood guide your way. Hey, do you think you'll, you're going to go to Canehurst Castle at some point? Do you think that's foreshadowing to say that you might go to Canehurst Castle at some point? Yeah, probably. It would be weird if you talked about a whole location that I never went to. But it wouldn't be that weird. Yeah, that's true. You okay? All right. Let you sleep it off. Hey, buddy. Hey, bud. What's his name? Does he have a name? Doesn't have a name. He's a skeleton. Jeremy. Jeremy's spoken. He did speak, is the thing. Yeah. And he will never speak again. That's me singing that song. Yeah, that was good. Can I recap the lore? I can recap the lore real quick. Please do. I'm going to uh, defeat some monsters while you do that. So get this. There was an old place of learning called Bergenworth, which is where we're headed to right now. They found out a bunch of shit about uh, various ways to sort of transcend humanity. One of the ways is this old blood that they discovered that taking it heals you. Then a member of Bergenworth took the old blood knowledge, left Bergenworth, and said, I'm going to start a church based around this. Left started a church, rose to power. Now high in Yarnum, where we've not yet gone, is the healing church zone. And then down here in the shit is the Bergenworth zone. And, um... Long story short, they started giving you the people the blood that heals them, but the blood also turns you into a big dog. That's basically it. Man, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Olive didn't like that. Dog. Puts the dog in him. So now we're going to Bergenworth to see what sort of um, shit they were engaging with down here. Do I want to go back and defeat that guy? And later we'll so. we'll go up to the the higher healing church to discover what shit they're engaging with up there. I saw you peeping. Someone said Amelia's the head of the church. We've been in their territory. Yes, we've been in their territory, but there is more higher up. Even further beyond. In the healing church. This goes above Amelia's head. This goes all the way to the top. To God. It doesn't open from this side. To a little thing we'll learn about called the choir. Which is God. It's not at all. I 
saw you. Watch out, he's got a gun. Well, I'm used to you gun havers. I defeated a whole forest of you, lads. Quicksilver! That's what they call me. Oh, Olive rises. <gasps> she rises. The moon, she rises. Who do you think was born first? And the moon, she falls. <laughs> <laughs> the woods is trapped. The woods is trapped. The woods is trapped. <laughs> you found the trap. Yeehaw. Who do you think was born first, Joy or Olive? Joy. Yeah. I think Joy had to come out to show Olive um, how to do anything. Although maybe when Olive was born, she was like a genius before the fever got to her brain. But I do remember when we first got her, she was essentially the exact same as she is now. Before she got all feverish. Gave me my echoes. That's a lot of echoes, actually. So I think she was always dumb. Your watch is going insane with buzzing. Yeah, what's happening? Oh, it's because I just got a million emails. Yay! I like two, how you Two of them it. are fun. Yeah, I do that every time out of habit. Two of them are fun emails. Fun emails, aka females. <laughs> Happy National Women's Month, everyone. Congratulations, I mean, we've done it. We've done it. Well, not we. Joe, but, but we've done it. Y'all, y'all done it. We've done it, Joe. Joe Biden. It's that mean of, of. Okay. I didn't realize we were all being bullies out here. That meme of uh, when Kamala and Biden won. Biden. Biden. Biden, Kamal Harris. I know what you're talking about. I'm I'm familiar with them. Yeah, and she called. I just Biden am not familiar like, with the name, the meme. Well, uh, I'm explaining. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> she just called and was like, "We did it, Joe. We won." And that was it. And it just like went around for a while. That's that's my cool story. That was before Joe Biden became dark Brandon and everything changed. Yeah. Yeah. So it's bad down here. <laughs> oh, it's only because of that guy. Though. I love the dude who's just like throwing like jugs of like shit at you. Yeah. And he has so many of them. He truly has an endless supply, it seems. Oh lord. Oh lord. I wanted to get the throwers out of the way. Like I was just trying to hit you with a shield instead of using his um, torch. It's an interesting decision. Nice job, well Thank handled. You. Thank you. I thought he called you a lesbian rat. <laughs> you lesbian rat! You lesbian rat! This game would be like, canonically, this rat has only ever had one romantic partner, the queen of the rats. And then later on you encounter the queen of the rats and she's sitting sadly in a chair and you're like, I'm fucked. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't make her get up. Well, it'd be the queen of the rats and then like her lesbian lover who like is gigantic and absolutely decimates <laughs> lesbian you. Lesbian rat consort, yeah.
I'm getting better all the time. I just want to say Lesbian Rat Consort is a incredible name. Like, if you want to start, like, a Twitch channel or something mm -hmm. and make your, your handle Lesbian Rat Consort or a band, like, anything, it's just really good all the way around. That's my brother's name? I don't think it is. I think you're lying. Why are you lying? I don't believe you. Lying doesn't make you cool, bruh. I'm kidding, it does. It's so cool. I wish I could be like you. Okay. That was just for a uh, crystal lizard, right? A little area. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't remember how to navigate this zone right. because it's all just like a forest. Yeah. Yeah, it sure is. Jeremy Sparkle. Sparkle. I always go a little bit into share. Yeah, you are you are bordering on share. <laughs> that was nice. Thank you. Good tone. You also kind of had some Jack Black in there. <laughs> You're that bucket's in your way. Jeremy Spokin, Spokin. Did do you believe in life after love? Me. You know, Eddie Vedder and Cher have a lot more in common than they think they do, I bet. Vocally. Yeah. I think they could each sing each other's songs, no problem. Do you think Cher has ever thought of Eddie Vedder once? No. no. I don't think she knows who he is. No. Whoa! They got me, almost. Your trap didn't get me. <laughs> <laughs> nice try. <laughs> Do you believe in life after limb? Do you believe in life after limb? Do not wake up. <laughs> Stay asleep. <laughs> Inside my limb. I really don't think you love me enough, no. Nice. You're kind of just taking an exquisite walk. <laughs> an exquisite walk. Yeah, I'm kind of just exploring. Hello. Oh, is that me? No. No. You know my hair. Faker. Identity theft. That was the once slur. <laughs> A little bit. I'm scared. Of what? <laughs> of him? Oh my god, lesbian rat consort just gifted five tier one subs. Yes! <laughs> I'm telling you, you made the right choice. Oh, this is the land of the lads, huh? There's an item in front of that big gravestone. I know, which makes me think it's important, but... Many a fancy lad have died here. Frenzied? This dude was frenzied when he died. Oh, it's poison too. I should have known. Or it's mad, maddening, frenzying. Whatever it is, you don't want it to get on you. Too bad. <laughs> you okay, buddy? What the fuck is that? It's a worm. This water's full of worms, I didn't tell you. This place sucks. Hmm. 
I don't like it one bit. Not at all. It reminds me of those sour candies I once had. Lim, everything reminds you of the sour candies you once had. Hmm. It's your only point of reference. <laughs> the only thing you've done with your life is eat a sour candy. I killed a worm earlier. Did you see that? Slow poisoning. Like sweat dripping down our dirty laundry. Slow poisoning. <laughs> I feel like if I'm poisoned you already. Syllables, you may as well just like. Keep being poisoned. Just like run around and get what you gotta get. Did Don't you get the, the big no. gravestone? But it sounded like some boys were after me and I didn't like it. You just gotta frantically run in. I'm not good at frantically running in. Dirty blood gemstone. We discovered this the other day when I was running away from that turret in Helldivers. I'm not good at running away from enemy fire. This is good practice. Getting lots of cold ass blood, that's for sure. Sure am. Hey, do you, hey. If you were to cube, hey, if the cold blood were like a coagulated cold blood, which I'm assuming it is because it's outside the body. Mm-hmm. And old. Uh-huh. And if it's cold. Yeah. And we make it square. Do you think it it could be a killer tofu? I was really feeling so hopeful about a payoff. <laughs> I don't know why. And it turns out the payoff was a killer tofu reference. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Out of the blue. Ooh. Oh. Guess who's back? Back again. Daddy's back. Tell, Tell a friend. A friend. What am I hearing? Is there a monster in there? Don't worry about it. That is the tiniest window. Am I? Just keep exploring and you'll figure it out. Okay. I know like vaguely where I am, obviously. Oh, why are you walking like that, bro? He's thinking about slurping. Carefully he got some health on him. Yeah, he does. Makes me nervous.
Nice. Okay. Woo! Mamma mia! Took his ass to town. Sure did. All right, there's a ladder. Okay. Birds. Please don't die. <laughs> yeah. I got scared for a second. God damn it. You're allowed to heal up all the way. No one will be mad at you for doing that, especially not me. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here, you stupid bird. That's a lot of you. Nice job. <laughs> You've entered Yosefka's clinic. Oh, the, from the beginning. Through the back way. It's the very first thing. It's where we started, right? Yep. <laughs> hey, is that normal? Hey, I haven't gotten like a lantern in a while. I don't know if I want to take on those those blobby boys yet before getting a lantern. What kind of stuff's been happening in here? Looks like somebody's been doing some, uh, experimenting. Got the communion rune. I'm glad they kept the knee. It's National Women's Month. <laughs> I have to respect women. I, I think you can go open the door to the the go to the other way. This lantern. Way? This way. Yeah. Okay. Like the first lantern of the game. Oh, where is you're it? In that building. Yeah. I just don't know where it I is. I think it's past the blue alien you didn't want to interact with. Oh god. Okay. I got scared of the alien. I don't know what to expect, and I'm scared to die. He's just a guy. Just hit him. Couldn't even pick it up and put it in storage? It's because you already have that lady's blood. That lady's blood. There's the Kanehurst summons. You wanna check that out in your inventory? Seek a pair of blood to descend the hunt. Is that me? Uh yeah. Hey. 
an old blood-stained summons inviting an honored guest to the forsaken castle Canehurst. Rather bafflingly, it is addressed to you, Limlamoose. Do not hesitate. The stagecoach leaves from Hemwick Crossing. Interesting. So you can go to Canehurst at this point now. And this will uh, get you back down to... Oh, yeah. Beginning. So now that that's open, you can go... Use this lantern? You can, or... use, you can use the lantern if you want, or you can oh, right, just cause... warp to it later if you want. I don't need to activate it. actually might it. be good to go and spend your runes. Oh, yeah. I Good mean point. echoes. I mean blechos. Whatever. Good thinking. <laughs> so Yosefka's clinic is full of aliens. Yeah, it seems that way, huh? Welcome home. What is it? Very well. Let me. Okay. I feel like our endurance is pretty good. I might do one. You could do one. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. About to find my worth. I'm gonna find my worth in the waking world. Might as well. Yeah. And you did get some new blood gems you could check out. That's true. And you can upgrade again if you want. Why not? So you got, um, can you, yeah, look at some of these ones here you got. Can, oh my God, Julia. <laughs> So this one gives me physical attack, but this one HP recover. And fire attack. And fire attack. Fire attack up 8.4%. But I don't use fire. No. I would just put on tempering if I were you. Yeah. Are you on the right thing? You are. Yeah. It's the only way I can see these little yeah. crescent moon put, things. Put that one on. What the? I got and another you, one. You got the communion rune, which is a, which is three blood vial. It's a better version of the communion rune you had. So I could do four, or I could do one, three, and then. <laughs> Rip Charlie in chat said instead of backseating, try sack beating. Hope this helps. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that. I'm a big fan of this, by the way. You could, uh, if you wanted to, spend some of your cold blood to buy it. Should I, though? It doesn't matter. I guess you're right. Just like if you want to, you can. <laughs> Sack beating for National Women's Month. How much does this give me? How much do I need? 18? Yeah. It's gonna be a lot. Well, you should have some, some pretty big ones, right? The frenzied one? Hmm. Yeah. I just used a frenzied, I think. Maybe it's worth waiting then. All right. You just buy it before you level up next time. So do I just teleport back to the sick room? Yeah. Then you can go up and uh, see what's up in that room yeah. where that woman was threatening you. Sorry, Olive. Sometimes Olive yeah, when she's She's got lying. her little paw curled like she's oh. making a little fist. Went the wrong way. I gotta go up the stairs. What you have to know about Olive is that she's oh, well. adorable. Hello. Splendid. Let me ask you a small kindness. You're soon off to hunt, I presume? Then, if you find any survivors, tell them to seek Yusefka's clinic. 
upon my um, Hippocratic oath. If they are yet human, I will look after them. Perhaps even cure them. I don't think I trust you. This sick. I know those gloves. Beasts, they are not to be feared. This time the night is long. I may be trapped here, but I should do something to help. You're in like a I gonna fuck you up fa uh, like stance. I offer a reward for your cooperation. Tempted? Well, off you go then. I didn't know you could have this happen in this order where you've already been back there and seen the aliens. And now she's being like, hey, it's all cool here. <laughs> Normally you see this dialogue first. Right. If you find I'm dependent. <laughs> but I guess you can't go back in this way. I thought the door would remain open. All right, I'm trying to look at her face. Apparently, if you don't fight her, this is what happens. Okay, she looks like a normal lady. But she's got her fighting stance on and a long stick. All right. Um. Hmm. But yeah, you, there is the shortcut to the backyard you opened, so you can go back around from here if you want to get back inside. From where? I'm sorry. From just where you were. Oh, so... Remember I... you opened that gate. Right. So I'm going back to the sick room. Sorry, everyone. Are the Oscars tonight? Whoops. What do you mean, whoops? I don't know. <laughs> I just don't pay attention to anything. Like, if you had known, we would have done something differently? No. I just didn't know. And it's like, whoops, I missed a, a thing a lot of people watched. Or watch. Why? Why? All right. You should be able to go like around and through the gate. Yeah. Don't worry about that. I don't like it, is the thing. You don't have to like it. There's a lot of things in this world you're not going to like. Damn. You're but right. But you though. can't do anything about them either. You're right. And that's one of them. I'm not going to fight you again, my dude. Just climb the ladder. Yeah, I was, I was, I was trying. Just climb the ladder. It's easy. Rory. Do you like that? It's a pretty good impersonation, if I do say so myself. Don't bird me. Don't bird me. All right, lady. My only affiliation with the Oscars is that when I was a kid, me and my parents would make a big event out of watching it. Oh, that's nice. And they would always pull out the sofa bed in the living room. And then we would get like a bunch of like snack food and like order snacks specifically. The thing we always ordered was fried pickle chips, like deep fried pickle slices that you dip in like a, like a sauce. That's sweet. So I always really enjoyed it because I got to stay up past my bedtime to watch the Oscars. And I, it, none of it meant anything to me, but it was just uh, exciting to eat pickle chips. And be in a sofa bed. It's like me in the Super Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. My parents don't really watch football, but we always got little appetizers every year. Oh, this is the one with the, the alien. The little, the little bubble boy. Ah, oh, moonlit sense. How did you worm your way in here? We've met. Very unfortunate. I had such high hopes for you. Well, I won't make any excuses. Would you mind leaving us alone? Who's us? Oh God. You'll do the rescuing, and I'll do the saving. But if you refuse to leave, 
Excuse me? She um made some tentacles come out. Sure. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> this woke up a bit. I'll soon have to practice rain. <laughs> Oh my god, you have a chain whip. Ow. I don't really like this room. I can't move. I gotta get out. I gotta get out. Damn it. How exciting. You don't have to be here right now, by the way. I want to. I can. Yeah, I'm just saying you don't have to. I want to. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just saying you don't have to. Okay. Uh, heard. But if you want to, you can. But you don't have to. But you can. Normally, I would be like, just throw yourself at her till you beat her. But, but it's international women. I mean, it's, it's women's month. Well, no, with this game, with the blood vials. It makes me more hesitant to like attempt to fight a million times because right right you don't right. want to deplete all your blood vials yeah that's fair no i think i can beat her i think chat got put in emote only mode <laughs> why would you what do y'all do, do? <laughs> they just won't stop backseating today for some reason people can't control themselves today Y'all, I'm not looking at chat. Yeah, Julia is not going to be looking at chat no matter what you say. So there's not even a point. I'm not looking at chat. I'm trying to have a a true first time. And I'm looking at chat, but I'm not repeating what you're saying purposefully. What do you think about her tenties? Don't ask me about that. Shit, I'm stuck on a chair. <laughs> she's doing cool walk at you. Yeah, she is. <laughs> you know you fucked up when she's doing cool walk at you. She might be kind of easy to parry because she's uh, swinging so often. Yeah, but I'm not fast enough. Oh, I thought that was going to be it for sure. Excuse me? Tentacled me. Ah, oh, you didn't step close, close enough. enough. Oh, the ad has started. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Sure is. Play cool. Damn. Okay. Don't want to fight you on the stairs.
Okay. Nope! It's the tentacles! <laughs> Sometimes I can't tell when she's tentacling and when she's... It's the other hand. Damn, I thought there was a follow-up. Not dead yet. The fuck is that? <gasps> no! How exciting. I've never worked on a hunter before. You didn't see how little health she had. No. Well, I'm trying to re read to remember if you should even be doing this or not. Let me know. Let me know what you find. I think you should not. I got so close, though. I think you, you can. But I shouldn't. But it's... I, I think you should not. Just to be safe, I think you should not. I wasted my time. I think you should go back to the forest. Okay. Where you came from. <laughs> I was so happy with how that was going. You did great. You didn't see the end. Well, I was trying to find out this information before you won. <laughs> And then she did a big blue move. She did a magic move. It's not here, is it? Is it here? You proved that you could beat her. And I think that's what's important. I didn't beat her out of respect for uh, Women's Month. Yeah. Everyone knows you could have done it. <laughs> Thank you. All right. What? Oh. Everyone in chat's very proud of your performance. Thank you. And so am I. Thank you. I need those. We need the bullets. We need the blood. Yep, I got that thing. I gotta remember to water my plant after this. It's true. You can't do it now because you gotta miss all this. I got a cat. She's really stretching out. Oh my what goodness. You, what, what do you do with those little feet? <laughs> Look at her little belly. She's got her legs really kicked out. You can't see them, but. You can see her little neutering tattoo. It's all out on display. Nice little slide. Thanks. Tony Hawk move. I was convinced that dude up there was about to throw. Okay. Oop. 
Okay. Deeper into the woods you go. Oh, because I went the other way and then there was a trap. Right. throw something at him? I did. I wanted him to come to me so that I didn't go near the other villagers. They, they didn't mind. No. They're like, if we don't turn around, maybe he'll just keep going. Oh! <laughs> okay, then there's another guy over there and I hear some... <laughs> You went past it like four times. <laughs> okay. Cool. They were watching their favorite show, Fire. The hell? It's not nice. It's not a nice way to. These dudes so who throw here. shit are just like waiting, just like staring at one spot and being yeah. like, "If I see anybody." Yeah. I'm throwing. Any excuse. Oh my god. I didn't realize he was a gun boy. I don't know how I didn't notice. Wow. <laughs> what Turn the hell? Turns out they beat your ass. Yeah, they did. You can't get longer. You're sliding. You're gonna fall, Olive. You're sliding off of the lap. You don't even care. You're falling and you're asleep and you don't even care. Is it just me? Wait, can you do me a favor? What's up? Well, once that guy's dead. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay. I'm trying to figure out if the way the saw cleaver transforms doesn't make any sense. I guess it does make sense. It it's makes just sense. sharp on both sides, huh? But yeah. you're not hitting them with the saw side. No. I guess that this is the cleaver side. Well, because that's yeah. the saw side. When I hit them with this, I'm hitting them with the serrated side. Yeah, and then the other side's the cleaver side. Yeah. I get it. Nice. Thank you. I didn't realize that move kept going. I feel silly. You can have an item for me. Thank you. That's what I wanted. I gotta get some vials back from fighting a lady I wasn't supposed to be fighting. I thought in my mind that when you transformed the saw cleaver, the saw side somehow ended up on the bottom again. Uh. And that's what I was confused about in my mind. Okay. I'm just going to go down this way again. Whee! It's a little shorty cut. Yeah. It's fun. I kind of look like Timothy Chalamet as Willy Wonka from the back. <laughs> you do. I'm cursed, why? Like, no, you're cursed. I'm fine. I'm doing all right. I'm just chilling, you're cursed. Oh, you fell in the trap. How did I not do that earlier? Don't die. Birds, man. You fell in the bird hole. Are you getting up, Olive? No. no. 
You're just adjusting. You will never be free. Oh! <laughs> You're bringing some wood with you. You guys are a little paw on your tummy. Yeah. Classic bird hole prank. They love doing that in this village. It's messed up, man. Hey, Julia, right. that guy's got a gun. You did it. Uh, clean, clean. Uh, <laughs> so clean. Oh, that's the thing. That's the, the attractor. Yep. The lure. As it is more... All right, Resident Evil 4-ass character. Hi. And now you want a piece of me? I don't think so. Someone asked if there was a lore reason why the birds were crawling around like that. And there is a lore reason. If you read some of the item descriptions, you find out that they nasty. <laughs> yeah. I do remember reading that somewhere. Oh, just feeling shy. <laughs> he was like kicking his little toes for a moment. Who, me? It's a base blood pellet. It's a base blood pellet. If you're ever curious about what a beast blood pellet does, it increases your damage. Well, it's a large medicinal pellet supposedly formed of coagulated beast blood banned by the healing church due to their unclear origin grants a spurt of beasthood. Please don't say spurt. Not in this month of... Ripping apart the flesh of one's enemies and being rained upon by their splattering blood invigorates one's sense of beasthood, feeding strength, and euphoric feeling alike. So it's like a temporary boost? What it means is you eat one, you get a little meter that starts going down, mm -hmm. and you got to start hitting as fast as you can, and the more you hit, the more damage you do. Your damage increases as you attack rapidly. That's cool. but it runs out really fast if you stop attacking. Right, so there's gotta be a lot of dudes around. Or you just have to have a fast attacking weapon and be willing to tank some hits. Right. Gonna lure you out here, if you don't mind. What? Someone's speaking like really normally up there. Watch out for these. Bog hose. Don't let them touch you. You don't know where they've been. Other than in the bog. There he goes. Okay. They're gonna give you a bog snog. <laughs> yeah, they are. All right, next. Next. I like how you can tell he's a beast and not a hunter because he just has a saw. There's no cleaver to it. <laughs> right. It's just a straight up saw. What if I want to be touched by the bog hose? Then that's your prerogative. That's your freedom. Go in the bog, get touched by a bog hoe, the sequel to Touched by an Angel. It was not as popular, but has a cult following. 
Baka. I don't know the rest of the Jaiho song. But oh yeah, I like that. That's fun. Yeah. You know, insert Bagho instead of Jaiho. Don't mind me, just breaking all your boxes. Never thought about the song Jaiho in a while. Neither have I. It's a good one. Not since the Slumdog Millionaire era. Yeah. Where everyone was listening to it. What oh, was guys. That? Was it on like Northern Lion when Slumdog Millionaire was like the movie answer for one of those like Wordle type games? And for some reason, the cover of it was like. Oh, yeah. So hilariously misleading. Yeah. Like it looked like a 90s rom com. Like both characters were like smiling and laughing on like a white background. I'm sorry. I just blew up. You did blow up. So I just I got a little worried about it. I just think about that cover and it's so funny to me. Yeah. If someone watched the movie based on that cover, they would be in for a rude awakening. They would be genuinely really upset. <laughs> so where is that coming? I see. The cannon on top of the hill. I'm on top of the hill. Can he blow this up? Nah. But that man can try to shoot you. You found the poster knife snail? Isn't it like so funny? I'll have to see if I can find it. It's a uh, pretty good. Stop shooting cannonballs at me, dog. <laughs> what the hell is happening here? Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> And everything was fine. <laughs> if you have a moment, I'll try to show it to people. You don't have a moment right now. Um. After this. You want me to do it? Yay! We're having fun! It's fun! Slum Dog Millionaire. My life's been nothing but easy street. What a party! <laughs> like, so wildly misleading. <laughs> That movie's like brutal. I saw that movie and it came out and it upset me so greatly that I've never seen it again. I thought it was a great movie. I it loved it. It was really good. It was one of those movies where I was like, God, I watched it and I'll never watch it yeah. again. The scholastic label makes it even more misleading. Oh, yeah, it did say scholastic on it. Is it like a book version? Like a children's book version? Here's why you should learn miscellaneous useless information in your life. I mean, it's not. That's the actual cover. It's also accompanied by the phrase, the quote, the feel-good film of the decade. It's not. I don't think it's a feel-good film. It's like saying Forrest Gump is a rom-com. <laughs> I mean, you feel good like at the end, I guess. But I'd say for 99% of it, you do not feel good. How does it feel to be inside one of the famous windmills of Holland? Oh, you have like a lot Watch of Watch out, he's gonna do it. He did it. 
I warned you he was gonna do it. No, no, no. Yikes. That's right. Some people don't turn into dogs. Some people turn into several snakes. Many snakes. Yikes. Um, is that me? I think you're close to a lantern somewhere. There wasn't any other exit from that tower, was there? There was. I just know we're, uh, we're getting close to time, so. There was this one. I think this one might be a shortcut you don't have yet. Okay, so I should go, I, you should, I should continue this You should press this on. Okay. I feel like I didn't do that much in this stream. Well, you've done lots of exploring. That's true. I, you know what? I don't need to fight you. Is it down here? Is it up there? I don't remember. You're just going to have to explore. Okay. Yeah, you did kill a boss. That's true. Oh, this is a shortcut, I think. Oh, this is, this is this place. Takes you back out to this. Okay. Yeah, and I think there's a lantern like right there, isn't it? Yeah, there is. You can go back and get your clothes you wanted yeah, to get. Yeah, that was my plan. I think it's to your left, right? Yeah, I hear it. Okay. I just thought that tombstone was shiny. A lot of tombstones are shiny. Mm. If they're wet. And guess what? Everything here is wet. That's true. Except for... Well... I was gonna say Blood Starved Beast, home, but... Hunter. She was, uh... Farewell, good may you... Sorry, I, I meant to go by clothes first. I just never come here when everything is like purchasable. Yeah. <laughs> Get your tomb prospector garb here. Your tomb prospector garb. I don't know if I like the hood necessarily. I don't think I need it. The hat, this top hat suits me so well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's a collar right there. Yeah. That collar goes all the way up. Look at it conflicting with my hair. How do you get a collar that big to stand up like that? I love it. it That's is, a lot of starch. It is baby. starched. What other? Okay. What a look. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared of germs. Fancy shit. Nah. <laughs> it's cold. Bucket hats are in. Gone fishing. Top hat. Yeah, I mean, how can you how can you say no to the top hat? It's great. Can I buy a level? Welcome home, good. What is it? Very well. Let me. No. You cannot buy a level. Farewell, good. May you find your worth in the waking world. I hope all of you find your worth in the waking world. Yeah. As well. Is this the outfit that Alexander wears? Kind of. Without the top hat? Maybe. Okay. Anyway. 
Um, we're gonna be at Mocha. We are gonna be at Mocha. Next weekend. Next weekend. Saturday and Sunday. We'll be there. So we probably won't be streaming next Sunday. Yeah. Because we'll be at Mocha all day. I imagine we're gonna be exhausted. Yeah. So don't expect Bloodborne next Sunday. Yeah, unfortunately. But, but we um, will stream Wednesday. Yeah, exactly. We'll be doing more uh, Ghost Trek. Also, um, oh yeah, someone wants to see the cape flip with this one. I don't know how well it's going to do. Um, very good. Got a little bit of flip out of it. A little, a little bit. Yeah. Um, Drawfee will be streaming tomorrow on Monday. On Monday? Tomorrow. Tomorrow, Monday. Tomorrow is Monday. At, um, 7 p.m. Eastern Time, as usual. We won't be streaming the following Monday, I imagine. We will probably take that day off since we are working the weekend. Yep. Correct. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's it. That's it. Thanks, everyone, for hanging out. Yeah. Appreciate y'all. We have a VOD channel, Secret Sleepover Society, on YouTube. Yeah, if you if you missed any of this, go watch the VOD channel. Go subscribe over there. Kaz also puts all of like our what we're streaming, when we're streaming news on there. So, you know, if you're not on Twitter and you don't want to be on the Discord, it's a good place to get your updates. So true. Um, Jacob's going to read some subs. So true. We will see you tomorrow at Drawfee. So true. Or Wednesday. Or physically at Mocha. So true. So true. See you later. It's so true. All right. Subbers and gifters, your time has come. Get your asses ready. I'm going to tell you who subbed, and everyone's going to clap. We got subs from JT Barnett, A Crystal Garden in Your Skull, Oodalali789, gifted five subs. Thank you so much. Side of Fire. My mouse scroll wheel is like so dog shit sometimes. Teeth Knight, Abobo187, Unnum Fool, Cybirdie. The Wonton Mon, April State, Kiwoa Smith, Sneaking Owlbear, Quirky Nerdy Lesbian, Sarcastic Fox, Inkara 1010, Unbelievable, Small Town Wizard, Moon Blacksmith, Lesbian Rat Consort, who gifted five subs. Thank you again, Lesbian Rat Consort. Thank you. Nihilods, Zulaya1728, gifted 10 subs. Thank you so much. Dominique. Spooky Bird, Alexander G413, Celestial Asexual, Splintered Light, gifted five subs. Thank you so much, Splintered Light. Noodly Felix, Martlet Sable, Zachary Dactyl, Just a Local Cryptid, Raven and Glasses, Stepsister Neck Twister, Tiffa on Twitch, Justin Sayin, Magna Florius Nerdity, Hex Codex, Leah Tortilla 98. Sergeant Pabs raided us a while ago. Thank you. Little Valentine, Nary Wind, Copper Catnip, Jordigan, Kiwi, Blucifer34, Curse of the Albino, Coochie Pinch, Albababababababy Cat12, Rebecca Roney, thank you, Reb, DNA Anya, Celia Seals, The Nerdy PT, Lunar Princess Ellie, Superhuman Foods, Lovesick raided us a while ago. They appreciate that, Lovesick. Ken's Pets Dogs, Ego D Bowl, Tired Kelsey, Xenix39, Animanimini, Teacup Dragon, gifted three subs. Thank you so much. Tickled Panda, Auburn G Art, Struggling Verbiage, Pigeon Toad, Miss Fortissimo, Redwood Seas, Moth Dad, Sucra Baroque, Verdant Tiger, Cogno Mintum, The Mr. Crowley, Slurrigy, Shaythoven, Not John Stamos, Unicycle Hippo, Jiztin Bieber, Lock Jess Monster, Kekona, ADM, Radiant Kaladin, Agon's D, Margie Cakes, Void of Voids, Chaotic Bard, 
Local Dreamer 1917, Marmalin, Odin Sten, Kai Kitty 98, Squee Potatoes, Professor Rad gifted five subs. Thank you so much, Professor Rad. Chrissy Pumpkin raided a while ago. Thank you, Chrissy Pumpkin. Trash Cannibal Lecter, Creature of Grace, Elf Will, Miranda Grace, Second Reckoning, Adam's Too Much, Himbo Writes, Solo Azume, Turtle Pope, Full of Bees, Princess Ring Pop, Joe Crazy Face, K9 Gaming 19, Odes Teller, Vampy Enchantress, Smallish K, Shadow Man 1188, Teacup Dragon gifted five subs. Thank you so much, Teacup Dragon. Cransom, Jamwise Gamgee, thank you, Jamie. Agatha 047, Author Amalgam. We go back to the top real quick. Dreamy Kate, Phantom Theory, Yurt Kurt, JT Barnett. I think that's everyone. Thank you all so much. Appreciate you watching as always. We'll see you tomorrow night on Drawfee and, and Wednesday night here again for more Ghost Trick. That's going to be it. By the way, those biscuits I made while Jacob was playing Helldivers were really good. She made some incredible biscuits. Yes. She's got the biscuit touch. <laughs> All right, bye everybody. <laughs> <laughs>